to bring you this video I have been biting my tongue and I have not been posting any videos uh, about it yet or any pictures even online because I wanted to, to uh, be kind of a big surprise I kind of hinted on it, about it uh, in a couple of videos back but as you can see I am rolling in my brand new Mac my 2023 Mac MD6 uh, I'm stoked was able to pick this up and uh, yeah, I was on vacation in Mexico when I got a phone call on the business line and it was a uh, very, very local to me, literally around the corner. Never been there before, but it was a truck dealership, uh, Bruckner's that you know, sells trucks and they also own BTI or BTE, BTI I believe, uh, that they do uh, the upfitting of these trucks as well. And uh, just to kind of introduce himself, he said he had saw my, seen my truck in the area. And he, I believe he also checked out my YouTube videos. But I uh, want to introduce himself, just kind of let me know that he's there if we ever needed any help with our hook lift. And uh, also to let me know that uh, they just happened to have a hook lift sitting on the lot uh, that just got done. And they hadn't even posted it for sale. So I jumped on the opportunity because I knew that at the time my truck was going through some issues with a PTO and all that other stuff, even though I was on vacation, but I knew that it was, uh, there's some, I, I have to main, I have to do a lot of maintenance to it and it's very hard to do with only one vehicle. So the goal is to keep two trucks. They do always say, you know, I've heard that it's always hard. It's the hardest to go from one truck to two trucks than it is from two to three or, or more. So even though I only have 12 cans right now and it is definitely overkill, I am probably gonna keep this, the Hino as well. I'm gonna fix it up. I've already uh, got the toolbox installed on this thing. I got a toolbox installed on the Hino. I was able to do them uh, in different days when I was driving the, uh, the other, this other trucks. So yeah, 2023 MD6 Max, still under DOT, still under 26,000 pounds with a adjustable 36 inch to 54 inch height swap loader hook which is awesome because it gives me an opportunity to buy used cans now that it seems like 36 inch cans are more available or uh, on the used market than 54 inch cans and when i do see 54 inch cans i usually want about as much as you can you pay for them brand new anyways so it's not really worth buying used but the 36 inch cans i do see some opportunity there uh, so it's kind of cool and I'm going to make a whole nother video on how to adjust it. It's pretty neat how it adjusts from 36 to 54. And uh, yeah, for those of you guys that want to get all technical, I have no idea the technicality of it. I know it's got a big ass Cummins diesel engine and a Allison transmission automatic air seat uh, ride, which is actually kind of uncomfortable to be honest with you. Um, it has no adjustment back and forth, neither does the bench seat. Uh, so I might be getting a, a different seat for this thing. Um, so later on down the road, of course, when I my bank account recovers, um, I'm not gonna get too much into technicalities all either of how much I spent for it. Uh, I, uh, I mean, I, I'll just tell you, it's 135 interest rate was fairly high, but pretty competitive with the way interest rates are going right now, especially for commercial loan. Uh, again, the Hino is completely paid off, so uh, it would be nice to have the cash, but then again, uh, it'll be nice to have a backup vehicle when this one does go down or have a driver drive that one because I don't want anybody else driving this one anytime soon. Um, not yet, at least. This is my, uh, this is my dumpster baby and uh, I'm not letting her go yet. So what else does this thing have? Uh, it's got some big ass 22 and a half tires uh, wheels it oddly weighs a thousand pounds less empty than my Hino does and it's just much bigger beefier 
uh, a roll right tarp system. It carries up to 16 foot cans. Uh, basically, I think it's 14, no, 12 to 12 to 16 foot cans. Uh, yeah. I made the jump, guys. I made the jump, y'all. Um, some of y'all might think I'm crazy. Some of y'all might think, uh, you know, more power to me. But at the end of the day, like I said, I I like the warranty. Uh, it's got unlimited miles. I believe three years unlimited miles warranty, and I can always up upgrade that as well. I'm stuck in some major traffic for the last like 40 minutes, so uh, hopefully I can get out of here soon. But uh, radio, Bluetooth, uh, differential lock. Uh, cruise control, air brakes. What else does this thing have? It's got all kinds of little features here and there. But guys, have any questions in the comments? Uh, let me know what you, uh, you know, what you think of this thing. Uh, I hope you like it, and it's, uh, you know, I'm glad that you guys are along for the ride uh, in this journey of this dumpster business. Um, I just keep, I'm gonna just keep trying to grow this business as much as I possibly can, and, and we'll see where we go, uh, you know, in the next few. Uh, next few years so until then guys we will see you guys on the next one